Some interesting tweets from Rochester, New York news media uh, regarding the shooting and killing of a man by a Rochester, New York police officer during a traffic stop this morning on Rochester, New York's west side. If you notice, uh, this tweet is from uh, Channel 8 in Rochester, New York, which is uh, the CBS affiliate. And it's interesting, as they say, that the RPD officers observed a handgun uh, in possession of, uh, of the you know, uh, man in the vehicle that was stopped. Doesn't say anything about if, you know, the man pointed the gun, if he displayed the gun, if he grabbed the gun, just in possession. And obviously that's not enough reason to shoot and kill a human being, right? So I just thought it was uh, uh, interesting as the little details start to come out. Um, and again, there's one simple way to show everyone, show the public what exactly happened. Is Rochester, New York Police Department release all, all the body cam videos of this incident so that we, the public, right, so that everyone can see why uh, Rochester, New York Police officers uh, felt they were justified in shooting and killing a person. Another interesting tweet is from Rochester, New York, uh, news media outlet, Channel 10. This is News 10 NBC, which obviously by the name you can tell it's the NBC affiliate in Rochester, New York. And again, uh, it, it basically says Rochester, New York police are not saying if the man uh, pointed or fired the gun at officers or in any way was a threat. Uh, made any kind of gestures or anything with the gun, right? So again, they're trickling out these little details. But again, there's one way to uh, fix this, basically, right? Uh, to erase any doubt, because the Rochester New York Police Department um, simply cannot be trusted. They cannot. They have a very dark, disturbing history of misconduct, of corruption, of lying, and of executing innocent people, okay? And regardless what crimes or anything this man may have committed, that is irrelevant. A life was taken. A cop shot and killed a citizen. So the way to fix this is to release all the body cam videos, all of them, and let the public see what exactly happened. And this is your standard, uh, usual, uh, very short uh, press release by the Rochester, New York Police Department, especially when they shoot and kill someone. You know what I mean? Not a lot of details, but it is interesting, as you can read uh, for yourself here on the screen, uh, that it says the officers observed a handgun. Again, I repeat, like I said earlier, to observe a handgun on someone is not enough reason to shoot and kill someone. I repeat, to observe a handgun, right, or any type of firearm, is not enough reason to shoot and kill someone. So, again, I repeat also. To erase any doubt, because we already know that the Rochester, New York Police Department has a long history of corruption, of misconduct, of lying, and of executing innocent people. To erase any doubt, and for complete transparency, the Rochester, New York Police Department must immediately, immediately release all body cam videos. Thank you for watching. Davey VTV.